Dirk, an NBA young boy. These two young men, y'all throwing the feds an alley -oop with this nonsense. Now, it's all these young men that's in the hood that come from crazy situations and they don't get to get out of their situation where they can make money, take care of their family, travel where they want to travel, live how they want to live, take care of any children they have, whatever. And y'all, these two young men, they have the opportunity. But guess what they doing? Beefing. About what? Beefing. I understand Dirk's situation with Vaughn and all that. I get it. You know what I'm saying? But if y'all not about to go out there and really, really risk it all and get locked up, then y'all set an environment for this negative, destructive music. And eventually somebody gonna get hurt. The fans, the, the blogs, they hype this stuff up. Grown men, way older than these young men. And, and, and they tell these young men, you know, hype these, these situations up when somebody get killed, everybody turns into Martin Luther King. Situations like this, the real OGs, the real older men need to step in and say, y'all need to chill this out. Y'all don't gotta be friends. Y'all don't gotta be homies, but y'all need to chill because this is no good. Seriously. Because some nothing's good going to come out of this type of behavior. You know what I'm saying? Somebody going to do something. Somebody that's running with somebody going to do something. And something's going to happen. How many bodies do we have in rap, even in the last past year, with this type of nonsense? So once it happened... Don't... Don't cry about it because everybody wanted it. You know what I'm saying? So back in the day with Tupac and Biggie, a lot of people, the, the, the magazines, they fanned the flames in that. They, add, they added gasoline and fire with this East Coast, West Coast, this and that. And both of them young men lost their life. They were young. And I think both of them at the time when they died, they were younger than Dirk and this young boy guy. So Dirk have seen to keep himself free as far as not in jail, not locked up, right? But this young boy, dude, you got cases and cases and cases. And now you're coming out trying to create an environment that young black men don't need right now. You know? So I don't see no good ending to this type of nonsense. I don't see nothing good coming out of this. And I, I, I'm, it's it's kind of crazy that people people forget cheerlead this stuff on until you know the obvious thing happen because something's gonna eventually happen. Somebody gonna try to get some rank or, or some cloud or you know do favors for one of these dudes. They're gonna try some stuff, and that's just gonna be what it is. And if you know Chicago like I know Chicago. NBA young boy don't want to be in no wood near no Chicago.